Good morning everybody, welcome back to another daily vlog from me and Jessie. Hi everyone, where are we going today Jessie? Oh thank you, you eat it though, that's your breakfast. <laughs> today we are off to um, like a sensory play group and I can't wait because it's been a while since, in fact, it's been ages since we last went to like proper play group like sensory group it's well before it was one anyway um you know we've just been going to soft play and doing his own thing uh, but this is actually like a proper baby baby group he's so happy to everybody oh that's nice oh thank you everyone give them kisses hi guys <laughs> you finish your breakfast off because we're going soon aren't we um so um, obviously, you all know Matilda, my best friend, has a little girl called Heidi, who is two months old. And usually, like sensory groups, it's like, you know, from age newborn to crawling, and then there's like a bigger one where it's like from walkers to whatever. Um, but this play group is actually from newborn to two year old, so they can both go together. So we've both booked on today. Um, I don't think it's like a... Like, when we went to Heartbeeps, if anyone's tried Heartbeeps, it was so lovely when Jessie was younger. Um, there was, like, toys and things for them to play with. This one isn't like that. I think it's more, um, I don't know. I don't actually know, to be honest with you. I don't know. I did check because I messaged the lady and I just said, what's it going to be like? Because, obviously, you all know Jesse is very active. He doesn't like to be still. He likes to explore. He likes to pick things up that he shouldn't. He likes to, you know... He's just crazy basically so i wanted to make sure that it'd be suitable for him um and i think it's like reading stories singing songs um so i'm hoping he will show interest and you know enjoy it because we're actually booked in again for next week too so fingers crossed he enjoys it i think you will won't you it's just he likes to do his own thing you know he likes to play with his toys sometimes mostly it's the stuff he shouldn't be playing with but i'm excited because we're going with heidi and matilda obviously so it'll be nice regardless and if he if it isn't for him then it's fine you know we've tried it at least so we actually need to get him dressed because we had to go out this morning to um drop jimmy's car off to have something done to it i feel like every time i say the reason jimmy isn't here it's because it's something to do with his car and um, we dropped his car off at the garage this morning for something doing to it and then he has gone straight to work i'm hoping he finishes early today though because i don't think he's got like loads on so hopefully daddy can come home early <laughs> but i have missed my little man so much if you watch the past two days vlogs he slept out on wednesday night today's friday mm. he slept out on wednesday night and then he was out all day yesterday then i went out and when i got home he was asleep like fast asleep so i've not i feel like i've barely seen him it's been horrible so i'm so excited to go to this play group and get some you know quality time with him even though i spend every day with every day with him anyway but i just i don't know does anyone else feel the same when they've not seen the baby like in i don't know i just feel like really distant from him as silly as that sounds i'm his mum and i see him every single day and i've not seen him for like what was it a day and a half I just feel really distant from him and it, it don't feel nice i don't know um but anyway we're back together aren't we jesse we're back together as a team i need to do something with this hair because i can't have it back like this because my front pieces keep falling out although that it's not too bad but um, i also need to get jesse dressed still in your sleep suit aren't you with a jumper on top yeah. so we actually need to set off in 40 minutes jesse so we need to hurry up and we also need to wipe your face because you've got blueberries all over it. And he has the worst bed head in the entire world. Isn't it? Your hair is crazy. I think I'm actually going to have to wet it to put it down because it's that bad. Yeah. Are you excited? And then I need to pack a bag, get his drinks ready and everything, take some snacks with us, you know, all the essentials. And then when we get home, we've got nothing planned, but this house needs a good tidy. Um, well, loads of washing to put away, just the usual house chores that I usually do. Need to get those sorted. And then it's the weekend, and then we've got Jimmy with us all weekend. We've got Daddy with us. How exciting. I get so excited for the weekend, so that Jimmy's with us. Uh-oh, what you done? Have you dropped a blueberry? Uh oh, shall we say hello to everybody again? Can you wave? Hi everyone. What a lovely smile hello. that is. Uh oh, what are you saying uh oh for? What are you done? 
I absolutely love his facial expressions. Oh, this weekend, actually, I don't know if Jimmy mentioned that we were going to sort Jesse's room out, take the side of the cot off and see if he goes in. Um, I mean, I don't know how it's going to go. We'll see. I also need to buy a bed guard thing because he will definitely fall out of that bed. It's not high, but obviously we don't want him falling out of the bed. But he's so fidgety. He is so fidgety. It's unreal, aren't you? Right then, have you finished your breakfast? You all done if you poured your blueberries? It's okay. Right, let's pick you an outfit out. Are oh, you still going? Let's pick you an outfit out and get you ready. And then we can go and have some fun, can't we? Say, yay! Well, that were a mini one. How gorgeous does my little man look? Jesse, you look adorable. Thank you for the kisses again. How cute does it look, guys? This dungaree set, I love so much. And I was going to put him in something else, and then I saw this and I thought, it'll probably be the last time I, I get to put him in this, because it is looking a little bit tight. Um, but these dungarees are from Asda, and then I bought, well, Ellie bought him this for his birthday, and then the um, long sleeve vest he's bought separately from Asda as well. So you look so cute. I have just wet his hair a little bit and just... Um, Patted it down just because it it was um, it was bad, Jesse, weren't it, your hair? Uh-oh. Yeah, we don't do that because that spilled all over your clothes, didn't it? I'm not sure how when it's supposed to be non-spill, but Mummy must have not put the lid on right. So, yeah, when I sent him to Jimmy's mum's on Wednesday night, um, I must have quickly filled his water bottle up and not put it put it on properly, the lid, because it's anti-leak, so if you pour it upside down, it doesn't come out, because he has to, like, suck on the straw for it to come out, and when um, Jimmy's mum got home, it had spilt all over his clothes that I'd sent him with, so she had to dry him out on the radiator, and I've just took his vest off <laughs> to put his new one on, and it had, um, it had, like, blackcurrant juice all over it, so my fault for not checking and rushing, as per usual, but I'm all ready to go, I'm just in my usual jumper and a leggings, Today, I really need to take this mirror back into my little dressing room. No makeup, as always, even though I did treat myself last night and put someone to go to Ellie's house, but I just prefer to be fresh faced when I do stuff like this. So I'm excited, really. I'm looking forward to it. He seems like he's in, he's in a good mood, so that's good, because this morning I was a little bit worried. You know, if he's in a bad mood, he's not going to enjoy just sitting down and. I don't know, we'll see how it goes. If this comes to worse, Jesse, we'll just have to go, won't we? If you don't enjoy it, you know. I always used to panic about stuff like that when he was younger, um, and I'm sure lots of you will as well, you know. Go to baby groups and you're scared they're gonna cry, but now I just think if that's the case, all I do is pack pack bags and I'll just go, I'll just leave. I don't really know where I'm going, to be honest, so when I do stuff like this, I like to go earlier, so I'm going about 20 minutes early because I'm not sure where I'm going. Obviously, I've got the sat nav, but I don't know about parking and things, so I always like to go early just to make sure. We need more than hopes and wishes for us to make it through the night. <laughs> wow, you are you having a crazy ten minutes before bed? Oh, hi everyone! I'm blowing kisses again. What is it? <laughs> 
<gasps> Jesse, Jesse, bedtime. Sleep time. Oh, did you see him put his head to the side when I said bedtime? Are you on the floor? Jesse, bedtime. Sleeping. Sleepy time. Ah, that is bad. <laughs> Wear him out before bed. You were in bed this time last night, you. <laughs> Weren't you? <laughs> Best sound in the world. Oh my god, I look absolutely dishevelled right now. <laughs> I look, look dishevelled. Oh my god, right. So, playgroup was so lovely. Jesse was so shy at first. Um, he always is when we go to new places or is in like new surroundings. I'll go in here because Jimmy's got sidemen on, but he's not actually watching him. He was shy for the first like 15 minutes, and then um, I got up with him and did some dancing with him. And then he really came out of his shell then, didn't you, Jesse? Did you really enjoy it? It was super lovely. We are back there next Friday. And then um, me and Matilda went for... Well, we said we were going to go for a coffee and then ended up getting a sharing platter of um, some food. It was absolutely gorgeous. And you had some chicken, didn't you? You had some dinner as well? You look so grown up today, Jesse, don't you? Why do you look like a two-year-old? Hi guys, um, oh it was so gorgeous, we had rice, sweet and sour chicken, um, vegetable, is it gyo gyo gyozas? Um, bio, I can't say this either, bio buns, the pulled pork ones, apple gyoza things, oh my god, it was so nice, um, and I really stuffed myself, like really, really stuffed myself, um, it was gorgeous, and then we had to go and pick Jimmy's car back up from the garage, and we came home, made Jesse's dinner, uh, mum came round for a bit and yeah it's now 8 o'clock, we should, probably should be getting Jesse up to bed to be honest because he is quite tired, he's not actually had a proper nap today, it's been like in the car and I feel bad because I've had to wake him up so many times, um, so he was not in the best of moods when we got out of the car earlier. What was that? Oh did you throw something? Uh oh, it was you, Jimmy. Wait, you're blaming it on Jesse. You are. Is Daddy blaming that on you? But yeah, it's been a lovely day. I've really enjoyed it, and I'm looking forward to the weekend and spending some family time together. Um, we're doing another walk on Sunday. I think it's going to become like a thing, you know. Me and the girls doing this walk on a Sunday. We've done it for the past two weekends, and I have enjoyed it so much. Uh, we're doing it again this weekend, so I can't wait. It's going to be a nice weekend, isn't it, Jesse? So. Yeah, he's just, um, he was super tired earlier and then now he's uh, just having that crazy 10 minutes before bed which I feel like every baby has or every toddler has. Hi, are you playing with your broom? Your mop, what is it, a broom? A brush, why am I calling it a broom? It's a brush. Are you going to clean up for mummy? Can you clean up? Or maybe you can clean up this that you pulled out. Hey, he got my uh, wish upon a candle order, didn't you? Uh, excuse <laughs> What are you doing with that? That's to build on. You're supposed to build your blocks on that. He's obsessed with climbing up things at the minute. Aren't you? Just be careful, you. You can't climb on top of that. Let's put it back down, look. And you can get your mega blocks and start building on that. Um, I also, I've got some tidying to do. Look at this. Um, I brought this in here yesterday to do my get ready with me makeup thing and then my camera ended up running out of charge so I never got to fully film it. Um... So it actually, do you know what, I'm getting, um, I'm going out tomorrow with family, with Jimmy and Jesse. Uh, we're going for some drinks for my cousin's birthday, so I might actually leave the makeup here and try and do another makeup, get ready with me. Um, one that my camera will actually be charged for so you can see the full thing. So I might just leave that there actually, it gives me an excuse not to tidy it up. Um, but I am very, very tired tonight very tired i've got some catching up on mobile and too as well i also need to edit my vlog but i've been doing some washing i've tidied uh, i've done wash the pots as well um just like earlier like i said just usual house bits that needed doing um so that's all we've been up to guys that's all we've been up to i am looking forward to the weekend and i'm looking forward to getting into bed who's my little slithering boy hey <laughs> look at jesse's sleep suit tonight his gran bought him this didn't she from the York Harry Potter shop, is it called? I can't remember what the shop's yeah, called in York. No, that's the Meadow War one. The shop that must not be named or something, I don't know. Uh, Somewhat like that. Anyway, he's got the Slytherin one on to match his dad's house. Yeah, you look so cute. Jimmy, it's bedtime. He don't want to be listening to them songs. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> it's still going crazy. Dancing!